Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about Numerar and the token NMR. Not only NMR token is a top mover on Coinbase, but I've also spotted some really cool stuff in the charts and I really cannot wait to share them with you. First, as usual, we're going to talk about the platform and the product. And then after that, we're going to dive into the price trends. We're going to try to predict the market using divergences. And if you want to learn more about this trading tool, divergences, how to trade with them, what they are, I created a video for this. Maybe we can use them next time in your trading strategies. Now, remember, if you enjoy my video, like, share and subscribe to our channel. Your support really matters. All right, it's time to get into it. Numerar or NMR is a unique token that powers the Numeray platform. Launched in 2017, Numeray is an edge fund based in San Francisco, but with a twist. It crowdsources artificial intelligence from data scientists worldwide to make investments in major stock markets. Numeray has a unique decentralized approach to data science. The platform hosts weekly tournaments where data scientists submit machine learning models to predict stock market movements. Participants can take their NMR tokens on their predictions, like what I do, and if their models perform well, they earn more NMR as a reward. However, if their models underperform, the staked tokens are burned. This system not only incentivizes accuracy, but also adds a layer of accountability to the predictions made. This is really revolutionizing. Numeray is essentially democratizing the hedge fund industry by allowing data scientists from all over the world to contribute and compete. It's not just a hedge fund relying on a few quants. It's a global community of data scientists pushing the boundaries of AI in finance. Numerar NMR currently holds a market cap of $96 million, reflecting its significant presence in the crypto space. While it once reached an all-time high of about 168 Dollar, the current price has settled around $13, and it shows how the market has evolved. Despite this, the token has seen a positive trend recently, with a 7.7% increase over the past week, and a steady 5.5% rise over the last year. These movements suggest a potential recovery, or growth phase. And it makes the token worth watching as we continue to navigate the volatile crypto landscape. So now it is time to dive into the detail of the market trends. So let's open a weekly candle chart here. Do you see how it is really convenient to get an idea about the price history here? We can see the general shape. And after a while of doing technical analysis, you start to read into the chart right away. Here, I can see the initial launch dump. Then after that, Numerair participated to the last rally of 2020, creating a high that was yet not higher than the original price. But we are still looking at a price of $96. And even if it doesn't beat the original price, it is a very great price compared to now with a current price of $16. We are looking at six time increase potential if we believe the last rally. The last rally created a massive head and shoulders that started to kill the price over the course of the last two years. And recently, the price had a surge in March, back to $55, not bad. Numerare is showing great potential if we go back to a rally soon, which I believe we will in about four months. 
Now let's zoom into the section of the price as it is in our current times. I am opening a daily candle chart to try to spot interesting movements. First I have to say I am looking at another mini head and shoulders here. Can you see it? But also some very cool divergences. Let's first list all the bearish divergences. Here there is one. And look at the price right after. It falls. Here there is another one bigger. And then the price falls. Now look at this one. This one is pretty ugly, I have to say. And to me, it still didn't go to the full capacity. My price target is really low here, about $2. We didn't go near what the divergence announced yet. To me, this is a bad sign. The price is very overvalued right now. And it is going up because of multiple divergences that are bullish. Let's look at them. First, there is a huge one here that is a reversal bullish divergence. It has a price target of about $31. Here is a more recent one that has already materialized. This is what we see here in our recent surge. So what? We have mixed signals. So first, uh, we have to understand something. Reversal types of divergences are stronger than hidden divergences because the hidden divergences rely on the price to form highs and lows. The reversal ones are harder to trump because they rely on the MACD highs and lows. So our bullish divergence is stronger. Our hidden bearish long red divergence can be trumped. If the price ends up making a higher high than the ones we calculated our divergence on. Technically speaking, it already did with the recent surge, but that's not a lot higher than the first one. So I do believe we will crash a bit more before going back up. We will eventually go back up, there is no doubt. Back up to a price target of about $30. Unfortunately, I do believe we will have to crash a bit more first. Maybe around $4 as a bottom. Okay, guys, that's all that I have for now. So I want you to remember that this is crypto. And you always need to be extra cautious when we talk about crypto. Even what I say, don't take it as facts. Always do your own research. I can make mistakes. And my trading strategies are never guaranteed. So always also have a great risk management plan. You're welcome to comment if you see something I've missed or if you disagree or if you agree with my predictions. Your feedback is always welcome. Let me know also if you want me to dive into a specific crypto for you. I'll be happy to do so. If you find this video helpful, like, share and subscribe to get regular updates. Until next time, keep an eye on the trends, stay curious and let's navigate these crypto waves together.